Et je donne maintenant la parole à Citoyens en Action pour la démocratie et le développement. Mr. President, I would like to draw your urgent attention to the distressing situation in Sindh, Pakistan, which requires immediate international intervention. The challenges faced by Sindhi people has reached alarming levels. The recent tragic murder of Hidayat Luhar, a committed school teacher by Pakistani security agencies, has created a pervasive atmosphere of fear and insecurity among Sindhis, highlighting the grave risks individuals face for their beliefs. Additionally, I highlight the recent manipulation of election in Sindh, further undermining the region's integrity. Fabricated candidates systematically marginalizing indigenous Sindhis, denying them fair representation and governance. For over 75 years, Sindhis have endured rights violation, resource misappropriation, enforced disappearances, extrajudicial killings, and violence against indigenous communities and religious minorities. Given the significant erosion of trust in the Pakistani government's ability to address Sindhi grievances, I urge the international community to stand in solidarity with the cause of sin. It is imperative to pressure Pakistan to respect the fundamental rights of Sindhis and enable them to determine their political future. I request the international community to support the Sindhis in pursuing peaceful self-determination to address and manage